The New Amsterdam Mayan Town Council held a press conference last Friday. More details from Shenis Beckles. The Mayor and Town Council on Friday last held a press conference to update the public on the projections and implementations of the Council for 2017. The conference was held at the Town Hall boardroom and all department heads were present to present their reports. At the meeting, Environmental Health Inspector Mr. Aklu Ramsod stressed the need for a cleaner environment and better solid waste management practices in the town. Thank you, Madam Deputy Town Clerk, ladies and gentlemen of the media. The Environmental Health Department of the Municipality, together with its Health and Sanitation Committee, of which comes with Shalzi of the Chairperson, has been carrying out a continuous exercise of visitation within the township here. And some of the areas that we encounter difficulties with, we, I'll speak on those areas. I commence with solid waste management within the township. We do recognize that the municipalities out there on a, on a daily basis picking up people's solid waste. And like also the media to capture some of these footage, you know, when you go about assessing the municipality. But regardless of the limited service that we are providing, we do provide a service and we're expecting the residents out there to cooperate with the municipality to ensure that we do not have this problem of littering. It speaks of evil in our township when we see, when we traverse the streets and roadways and we see this amount of indiscriminate dumping taking place. And so people that is doing this, you know, so we would like to have, we'd like to see a change of attitude from our residences as it relates to solid waste management within the township. We have been collecting, we have a monthly schedule, we have a fortnightly schedule, we have our difficulties, we have our downtime. Fine enough, but that is not enough reason. You don't have any reason to be dumping your waste all over the place. According to the town's treasurer, due to insufficient amount of taxes being received by the council, they are unable to effectively execute their duties. General Foreman of the town, Mr. Charles Johnson, highlighted that it is illegal to do construction without first notifying the council. I want to do the uh, building construction. It is uh, uh, a contravention for anyone to be carrying out any construction on their property without the first knowledge and permission of the council. Um, we've noticed that a number of persons are doing uh, you know, changing their fences, um, changing parts, extensions of the home, changing the entire design without first contacting the municipality. Now, um, for residential uh, construction, if you are caught 
contributing is a fine of 50,000, and for commercial, it's a fine of 100,000. Um, the other thing is um, the drainage system in the town. Um, we have done some extensive works in Stanton and parts of uh, central Namsam, but we are on a continuous um, drive to get these uh, drainage facilities before the next spell of rain comes. So, you know, we won't have the problem of uh, flooding in Namsam. Another issue that I know about that is affecting a lot of persons out there is the state of the streets. And we are going to be addressing those in 2017. We have um, some streets that are set up that we're going to start construction shortly. Um, we have some in Stanton, for example, about 38, uh, 41 Stanton um, East, and a number of other streets. Shinny's Beckles reporting for Channel 8 News.